via, via, vieni via di qui. Niente più ti lega questi luoghi, neanche questi fiori azzurri. Via, via, neanche questo tempo grigio, pieno di musiche e di uomini che ti sono piaciuti. It's wonderful, it's wonderful, it's wonderful, good luck my baby, it's wonderful, it's wonderful, it's wonderful, I dream of you, chips, chips, do 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 Carrara has unbelievably fascinating marble deposits. My wife Iris and I first visited these quarries in 1982. This first journey would be followed by five subsequent journeys. Carrara is hardly a beautiful holiday destination, but its attraction lies in the fascination of stones and the fascination of marble. I had been thinking of buying a quite large piece of stone for a long time. I wanted to create a large work in this white traditional stone, in this marble from Carrara. It is not easy to find the right piece, however, it takes time until you have the right color, the right shape and the right weight. I traveled to Italy without even a drawing in my pocket and without even a picture in my imagination. I simply wished to locate the right block of marble. On every occasion when such a block appeared before me, I felt that it possessed a kind of soul, or even a life of
I imagined that I would make an immediate start on measurements and drawings as soon as the block arrived, and that I would work in my usual way. I had actually slightly overlooked the fact that I wanted the block to guide me. I had this basic idea in mind at the start of my journey. As soon as I had selected this block, however, I resorted to my old rhythm by making models and drawings. I did not work anymore. These forms, which I believed would come automatically as I thought about the sculpture and the material, failed to appear. It was a blockade. For two long years, I was unable to draw anything new and three-dimensional. Then, after two years, I sat down at my drawing board one morning with my pencil and began to draw cloth forms. These were fabrics in motion. Communication happened and the block directed me to draw a cloth for it. If I say again that I have found my solution, it was actually the block that brought the solution to me. I was able to draw a form that is soft, a form that is moving, in a material that is unmoving and hard. Marble is a metamorphic rock. Imagine that it was once a piece of limestone moving around in the interior of the planet for around 50 million years, where it was transformed by the heat and the pressure and returned to the surface as marble or was exposed by erosion. This is the definition of a metamorphic rock. I felt that the rock had traced a route from the original limestone material via marble and then onwards from the quarry to the sea along the transport route until it finally arrived in Switzerland, in Buchegberg. In some ways, this also resembles a change in location or, at any rate, an additional journey made by this marble.
Dancing with the dark lands Just thinking how to get thought and see The block already possessed a good form, a natural form of the mountain and the stone breaker, and it is now undergoing a further transformation involving its new form, namely the form of a fluttering face tower. And although this is not a commission where I work from a fixed location and plan a sculpture or some other artistic work, I nevertheless start from the assumption that, just as the block has guided me, so the story continues. The story of quarry, the transport route, Switzerland, Kuchekberg, and the transformation of form. The story actually exists, even though the end is still not in sight. I could imagine both routes, back to the origins, perhaps with the new form to find the way back to Tuscany or taking the story forward into entirely new surroundings into a completely different environment with a new architecture all around. It was very easy for me to imagine that by taking this form and this story into consideration there is an associated architecture all around. I would be very happy on both of these routes.